This section focuses on the use of our A1 with respect to various kind of cards and tags. As mentioned earlier, our proprietary A1 supports a wide range of tags and cards. The tags and cards under consideration here would be the ultralight tag and the Mayfair tag. To access the option of using the card and reading the data from the card, we need to press the second button, which is the card tag option. Once we move on to this screen, we will see a wide range of options. The first option is the read UID, which enables the user to read the unique identification number. This option is valid for all kind of cards, tags, and all kind of devices which can use the AVEN, since each of the device contains a unique identification number. The second and third option, which is the read tag data and the write tag data, enables the user to read the data within the tag and also write the data onto the tag. The last two options are valid for the ultralight tags. We will start our procedure with the ultralight tag first. Pressing the last option enables us to read the data inside the ultralight. We can also use the read UID function, which enables us to read the UID of the ultralight tag. The last option is the option to write the ultralight. If success, we are presented with the alert dialog box, which says that the writing process was completed. Our second option would be the use of the Mayfair card. We can again use the read UID function to read the UID of the Mayfair card. We can read the tag data. This tag data corresponds to sector number two. As mentioned, there are 15 sectors provided in the Mayfair card. However, for demonstration purposes and for security purposes, we are only considering the sector number two. The user can use other sectors as well for storing of data. The last option is to write the tag data. If success, a write tag data OK information is presented to the user, and the user can then check the information. As explained before, the data and the number text field are the information available to the user so that he can choose the sector number and choose the data which he wants to be written to. This explains how our A1 can support a wide range of data and cards, both for reading and writing purposes.